Welcome back. Today I want to begin with a very obvious starting point of our homes, the entryway. We all obviously have one. If you're in a single family, you might have a couple of entryways. But I think what rings true for the majority of us is that no matter what kind of entryway you have, it's probably an overlooked space in your home, which is fine in the day-to-day -day, in living of our lives. These spaces generally don't matter to us. However, if we're going to sell our house, this is literally the first impression a person's going to have of your home. So we really need to make sure we make the appropriate edits to get this show ready. So what I'm going to do is turn this around, show you what my entryway looks like, and we're going to go over the differences between staging and living. So here in my home, we have some of the obvious culprits here. The extra shoes just kind of hanging out. I've got a wreath that just never made it to the front door. Puppy not included. My purse that isn't in its home. Jacket hasn't made its way onto the coat rack, which also does not stand up straight. And we've got a couple of random storage baskets just overflowing with puppy stuff. So what I'm gonna do is transform this space and then talk about what I did. As you can see, the miscellaneous shoes are gone. We removed the small mat so that it photographs better. All of the extra storage baskets, I greatly reduced the amount of items in there so that they wouldn't be overflowing. And the coat rack that used to be here is removed. What we want people to believe is that there's plenty of storage in your entranceway, even if that's not the case. As you can see, it doesn't take a lot to transform these entryway spaces. That's why it's a great place to start if you're sitting at home getting your house ready for sale. A lot of it is just putting our stuff away and getting rid of any storage issues that are obvious from the get-go when we come into our home. So I hope you enjoyed today's session on entryways. Abigail is going to be doing a post that's far more in-depth with some tips on all different kinds of entryways. And then tomorrow we're going to be moving on to kitchen. See you then.